So guys, I've got this uh, 12 valve here and I'm gonna show you how to get it running if you have air in the lines. Um, so let's say you've done a motor swap or you've changed a fuel filter or something and now your motor's not running, this is what you gotta do. So I've got this one out here on a stand and uh, it's going in a truck, a uh, square body that I have. But pretty much what you wanna do is you wanna go through and crack all of these. These are all 15 millimeter, I think, I'll have to check that crack all of them and then just crank on the motor until you see fuel squirting out of each one. I was wrong. It's a 17 millimeter. So just go ahead and crack all those. So we've got all those cracked now. Um, so now what we're gonna do is crack, is just crank on it. Now what this does is let fuel push through the lines and push all the air out. So when, you're, when I'm cranking on it, watch cylinder number uh, one here, or the front one, and you'll see fuel squirting out of it. Once you see fuel coming out like that, you know that that line is good and there's no more air in it. So do that until you see all of them squirting and then we'll move to the next step. Okay, so now we got all the fuel lines uh, bled. Um, so now I tightened them all back up. Make sure you got power going to your fuel shutoff solenoid, which is right there on a VE pump. And then we're just gonna start cranking on her and hopefully she starts.